doing okay, Bigby? What the hell? Oh, that was you. Hollow point bullets are a nasty business. The silver slug deformed and shredded on impact. He'll be okay, though. Hmm? He'll be okay? His internal organs are positively riddled. Yeah. If I don't extract every single scrap of silver, he's liable to suffer some long term toxicosis. <sighs> Easy there. Try not to move. <clears throat> We can't keep needing this way, old boy. Yeah. I figured I'd be done before you were conscious. But there's little I can do for the pain. Just stay still and let me finish. What... <clears throat> what happened to me? There was... You got lucky. And found yourself in the care of a most skillful surgeon. Sure. Me. Please, Bigby, don't move it. Doctor. Yeah, can we do something Look, about the I'm arm? I'm engaged, saving his life at the moment. But if the fractured extremity concerns him that much, he can set it himself. Great. That's really great. Mm, no, that's bad. I didn't do it. <laughs> Let's try it again. Did I do it wrong? I don't think I did. Okay. Fuck. Can you bandage me up? Hmm. Not bad. That'll do, I suppose. He's lucky to be alive. And he won't be next time if he keeps going like this. He didn't listen to me before. Maybe he'll listen to you. I don't know about that. Well, he should. There are limits to what even I can do. This is the job. Quiet. Just relax. <laughs> Excuse me, Miss White, but perhaps it'd be better if you gave me a few minutes to finish with him. Yeah. I, I think I should stay. At least until he's... Out of the woods. <laughs> Believe me, Bigby couldn't be in better hands. And I need the space to work, so if you wouldn't mind, we'd appreciate the headroom. Stick around, all right? I don't know if I trust this guy. <laughs> oh, please, I could do this with my optic nerve severed. We'll be done in a moment. Just please, give us the time. Hey, Colin. Hey, Doc, how much longer? Colin, leave him be. It's finished when it's finished. Because I once watched a vet sew a turtle together in ten minutes flat. Colin, you're not even supposed to be here right now. Oh, really? Where am I supposed to be? I'm here to take care of my friend. Could you please not distract the doctor while he has my chest cut open? Yes, that would be helpful. <sighs> there. All done. Great. How do you know? This isn't a habit you should keep to. Having visits with me, and, well, this time, this time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Shit. Miss White, he'll be fine for light duty, if he can figure out what that means. He knows what it means. It's just been an unusual couple of days. Yeah. I know. But please, don't give him the excuse. Yeah, but we need to do something. His body will eventually give out. Take care of him. Please. I will. He'll need rest, I assume? Sleep mostly. Just keep watch. And make sure he doesn't get into further altercations. I'll try. Snow has enough to deal with, Swinehart. I can take care of myself. Yeah. Clearly. Anyways, guard against, as they say. Miss White? Sheriff, Colin. Swiney. Swiney.
Miss White, Sheriff, and Colin. Interesting. Unfortunately, there seems to be a hierarchy. So, how do you, um, feel? Better? It's Bigby, Snow. He'll be okay. Hell, I've seen him take worse. Not as good as can be expected. What are you expected. doing, Colin? I think. So, not well, then. I'm glad you're not dead. Mm, yeah. You, uh, you stopped breathing, you know, when you passed out or, or died, I guess. It, um, it kind of scared the hell out of me. I've never seen you like that. And when Swineheart arrived, you know him, he's never worried. And even he thought you were... Um, pretty hard to kill. Yeah, but not, it's not impossible. Yeah, you were really fucked up, man. You Jesus look like when you take Christ, an action Colin. figure and bend its limbs the wrong way. Colin... I'm just saying, I was worried about him is all. The guy hasn't had a night's rest in days. Well, I'll get some rest when this whole thing is done. What whole thing? What's even happening out there? I mean, do you guys have, like, a plan or something? And who should I be asking? Should I be worried about the Crooked Man taking over? Or is Crane still the thing? The Crooked Man, Bloody Mary, yeah. the Tweedles. This is bigger than what I thought it was. The crooked Man seems to be the, the yeah. primary suspect The Crooked right Man now. came out of the shadows for a reason. For him to attack us so blatantly like that. He either feels invincible or desperate. Well, if those are my two options, I don't think I'd pick desperate. What do you mean? You traded Crane to save Bigby. I'm just saying, that's not exactly something you do when you're playing with house money. So he called my bluff. It's not like I'm gonna let Bloody Mary just murder... Yeah, uh, thanks, Snow, for all that back there. No problem. Thanks? You're not pissed that Crane's flown the coop? Calm down, Colin. Or that the crooked man thinks he's got snow under his thumb. We're all mad about it, Colin. What else could Snow do? If she didn't yeah, hand Colin. him over, my ass would be down the witching well. Crane still would have been taken. Okay, okay, I'll take your word for it. All I You're care being about a real right dick, now Colin. is... Just what does the crooked man want out of this? I thought he was just a loan shark. But clearly, he's operating in other circles. It can't just be about Crane, right? Getting him out of town? Is this all about the murders? Crane can't be useful to him anymore. So what could this have to do with Faith and Lily? How long has this stuff been going on? Yeah. Crane was a puppet, and the crooked man worked the strings. But, but this is all about control but he's of still not the killer. Care. But then what do prostitutes have to do with it? Lily? And Faith? I don't know how it all works out yet, but I know it does. Somehow. The Crooked Man declared war against us last Basically, night. Basically, yeah. At least that's what I thought when it happened. But now I see this war has been going on for years. We just haven't noticed it because our way of doing things is broken. Because yeah, you, you, you ignore the We trace. need to do things the right way. What does that mean? The right way. Call it. What do you Shut think up. I mean? I don't know, but it suspiciously sounds like your way. Bigby's the one on the front lines. You can't give him a leash. He doesn't work that way. Mm. A little restraint and thought behind things will never hurt anyone, Colin. Look, I know things haven't gone great recently, but we're still doing our best. That's not good enough. So, starting now, we do everything cut and dried. By the book, straight as an arrow. No, I think pure you're... is driven snow. You're... I'm not saying I'm the arbiter of. Sure, you're not. Hmm. This town has enough monsters. What happened last night? What you turned into? It can't. No, happen that wasn't again. the problem. We need monsters to fight monsters. Colin, if I really believed that we needed him to lose his flippin' mind at a moment's notice, then that would mean I'd lost all faith in our ability to help this town. Just let that side of you be done, okay? Be done and buried, and we can all move on. 
We were under attack. Yeah, Snow, that's no, you're what did you being real, real do? selfish and there naive. There are degrees. Degrees? I only ever do what's necessary. Really? Do you believe him? Yeah, I do. Look, Bigby, I care about how this is done just as much as I care about it getting done. So for that, you want to give him a handicap? Like the bad guys will worry if shit gets sloppy. Everybody wants Bigby to smile and shave and take a shower now and then. <laughs> Hell, I'm practically the president of the Bigby Don't Be Such a Dick Club. But this is the wrong fucking time to put shackles on him. Hold on, who says yeah. I'm sloppy? I always yeah, do Bigby what isn't I do sloppy. For a People just, It's just... all turned out how you planned. He'll get the job done. Just let him do it. Yes, I'm no. going to... I'm going to let you do it, okay? It's just that... Now that I'm deputy mayor, I need your respect. You never... You never lost and my respect. this situation has to end. What situation? All unglamored fables starting today have to go and stay Snow. at the Oh, give me a fucking break. Are you gonna let her talk to me like that? It's been the rule for a reason, Colin. And Bigby knows it's for the best of the town. It keeps everybody out of trouble. I don't trouble. think that's that's any of my Everyone my just calm business. down, all right? I'm perfectly calm. I'm not. Tell me right now. What's it gonna be, Bigby? Who'd be calling Bigby? Wolf's Bigby. Residence. That's rude. Oh, Buffkin, what is it? Okay, so you need to I'll let calm down. Thanks. Guess who's waiting in your office right now? Bluebeard. Nerissa. Oh, Nerissa. That broad from the pudding and pie? Yes. Apparently, she told Buffkin that she has something she needs to talk to you about. But that she'll only tell you. What do you think that could be? Mm. Uh, Bigby's got an admirer. You always do well with the, uh, disenfranchised. She knows something. She's helped me a little with the case. Yeah. Maybe she has something else. Maybe she does. I should get back to the business office. I've left Buffkin alone for too long taking calls. Yeah, he's probably drinking. And I should probably change out of these clothes. Yeah, probably. Consider the discussion tabled, but not over. Let me know when you're done with Nerissa. Aye, aye, Captain. She's a piece of work. Colin? Hey, you're not really gonna send me to the farm, are you? I mean, she seemed real serious about it. I don't know. Yeah, Snow I think so. I think, she's just, I think she's just scared. The crane thing hit her hard, and she doesn't really know who her friends are right now. Oh, okay. I get it. Don't worry about it. Thanks, Bigby. Yeah, I think that, that is what's happening with her. But that's also why she sort of can't be in charge right now. Oh, that's the farm. Right. Have we seen his office? We've seen his house. Oh, hi. How you doing? It's gonna stutter again. Because what a fucking trash company. Seriously. Hi, Nerissa. What's up? Have a seat. Wow, oh, you smoke a lot in here. She's so I, sad. Um, are you okay? You didn't look good last night. I wasn't sure you'd be 
you know, around. Don't be fooled by this. I didn't get the worst of it. <coughs> yeah, you should maybe stop smoking. Really? You cough and then you smoke? Huff and puffs. Not many people smoke those. What the fuck just happened? What was that? Thanks. There's not a lot that fuck. I can talk about. You know that. So that spell crane was trying to break. It's not just while you're at work, huh? What I mean is, I don't want to waste your time, but I don't want you wasting your own time either. Okay, then tell Back me something. Back in the dressing room, at the pudding and pie, I told you what I was looking for, and you found a way to tell me. You yep. sent me to the open arms. Maybe that'll work again? You can try. I just... Your lips are sealed. Go ahead. It might work. You're here because the crooked man just sent Crane to the bottom of my list of worries. And you have something you want to say about that, right? Your lips are sealed. These lips are sealed. Yep. If I could answer you just like that, I wouldn't have had to make that appointment with you. That cigarette is no, very long. I guess not. I need to ask the Sometimes, right questions. Well, we have to find our way through life on our own. Grasping and fumbling in the dark. I... I used to have friends to help me find my way. But now... They're gone. And I don't know what to do. Okay. Are you trying to say something about Faith and Lily? No, that's, that's too, too what straightforward. What I'm saying is friends matter. And I... I don't have any left. Okay. So I hope you're looking after yours. Are you? Look around you. Who are you talking about? Are my friends in danger? Those lips, those lips are sealed. I'm sorry. I thought I could do this. I need you to know I want to help, but... But... It's okay. Yeah. Take your time. You've been the most helpful. I'm sorry if I'm wasting your time. I Is thought that... I knew how to say it. Ribbons. Faith wore one too. Yeah. That's the spell. Do you like it? Hmm? Do you? It's not how it looks that concerns me. It's what it does. Yep. That's why you can't tell me anything. It's the ribbon, isn't it? Your lips are sealed, I know. What can I do about the ribbons, though? Can can you maybe not take them off, but maybe I can? You mind if I just... No! These lips are sealed! What? You can't! Just stay back! You can't do that. Oh, that's how, that's Slow how down. that's how they it's get right. decapitated. I'm not gonna do anything. That's how they get decapitated. Please, don't. So when you try to remove the ribbon. Okay, I get it. So the ribbons, if you take them off. Okay. How is this not illegal? I mean, it probably is. If anyone finds out I came here... That's probably Snow. Listen, Sheriff. Can you keep this conversation between us? I could be in a lot of... trouble. I shouldn't be talking to you. Gonna have to tell Snow. She has to know about the ribbons. If you have to, just yeah. don't tell anyone else.
Snow? Sorry, I just need to talk to the sheriff for a moment. Please excuse us. One minute. I might have a new lead for you, but I don't know how solid it is. Yeah. Beauty and Beast called the office just now. They said they wanted to talk to you about something. I wonder if they've heard about Crane. Thank you for listening, Sheriff. You should go on to your next business. Right. I don't think you'll be wasting your time. Think, wait, you don't have to go. No, she was telling us something. Beauty and Beast that are a good was... lead. Uh, no, 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 I got it. That's one way to send a message. What did she tell you? I didn't mean to rush her out. Did you get anything from her? She couldn't really say anything. Yeah. The magic that Crane was talking about, it's in the ribbon. And you can't take the ribbon off? Nope. Or... It's how Faith and Lily died. Yep. Okay, then. I think maybe Crane... Crane got... Uh, excited and tried so to take the ribbon off. So, about Beauty and Beast, do you think there's something to it? Is this the right place to look? What could they know about the Crooked Man? Or do you think they yep. just heard about last night? That's what Nerissa was doing. Telling us to go there. I think she made it as clear as she could have. Let's go. Hmm. You hmm. know, Beauty came to me a while back. She was looking for financial assistance. I told her there was nothing I could do, and and she said that right. meant she'd have to go somewhere else. She owes money. Does she owe money to the Crooked Man? Bigby, you don't think she meant that she was going to go to the Crooked Man, do you? That would explain why they called. We need to solve this before something else happens. Who knows what? I have other matters to attend to. You're not coming with me? That's weird. And you didn't want to tell me what you were into either. With good reason. Look what happened. Uh. So that's back on me now. I thought we agreed that was settled. You said it was settled. Keep bringing that, that up. Mean I have to agree to it. Hey yo. Oh. Let me what in, do beast. you want? Beast? Well, you're just going around knocking on doors? I'm sorry. Were you expecting someone else? No. That was... Forget it. What do you want, Why baby? are you... What's up with your face? Listen, I've had a shitty night. Do you think you're the only one? And I really don't want to deal with the runaround. Snow said you called and wanted to talk to me. Well, I didn't call. Must have been beauty. She's been surprising me a lot lately. You're gonna let me in, right? Can I? So have you, Bigby. Yet, with all the sneaking around and secrets, somehow I'm oh still the bad guy. Oh my god. In this. I've had to hear about it all night long from her. Who is it? Who's there? Are you gonna let me in or what? Yeah. You should. It's your pal, Bigby. Oh, why Hi, do you baby. have you know Please this excuse this us for you just have... a minute can I talk to you in private yes your apartment Let's. is way too fancy for for a couple struggling financially mm. sorry to say I guess I really do have the smallest apartment in the woodlands I can already tell you're going to make a problem out of this what's he doing here we don't need to bring him into this beast I what's going on here him. not after the way he went behind my back and then you run and what? call him again? Well, I trust him. Of course you do. He was keeping secrets for you. Hmm. It was one Talk about living thing. in the past. Yep. Do you want to keep fighting you about that? You should get a divorce. Do you want to try to sort this out? All I'm saying uh, is we can handle this on our own. You didn't have to bring him here. We're yeah, out of that's money. That's going to be bad. And answers. That's why I called. We'll finish this later. But we need to talk to Big B. Hey, yo. Fine. If you want to talk, want to we'll listen talk. to their conversation? Oh, I know what the electric bill is for that thing. <sighs> Sorry, it's been a long night. Yeah, you know what they say: centuries of marriage come with centuries of baggage. Beast, I gotta come on. say, your place—it looks uh, 
Expensive. What you're, do you mean by that? You're all for appearances. Ooh, no, really, I want to know. What are you trying to say, huh? Did you come to give us decorating tips? I thought you were having money problems, but it doesn't look like you're suffering to me. Yeah. Snow told me you went to her for some financial help. Did you end up going to the Crooked Man? I didn't know what else to do, so... We should deal with this on our own. Bigby's just going to complicate this. I beast. called him I will and fuck I want you to up. see if he can help us out. Why are you being like this? I'm just trying to do what's best for us. That's all uh, I ever do. Well, what kind of trouble are you in? Either it's the money or it's something else. I gotta know one thing first. What if we did have something to say about the Crooked Man? What if we talk and you don't get him? And all this comes back on us. We'd be risking a lot. I can't do anything if you don't tell We've me. We've seen what happens when you cross the Crooked Man. And I don't know if it's worth it. If you can't give us certain assurances. I can't protect you think you you're the only ones in danger? If you have info on that crooked bastard, I need to hear it. Otherwise, I've got better things to do. No, please don't. Other people are gonna die because of you. What the fuck is going on? You're in so much debt? Look around you. This isn't the way people short on cash live. Look, we're used to a certain kind of lifestyle, okay? Fuck we you. couldn't just give that we up. We never meant for it to get like this. It's just that we had nowhere else to turn, and we got in over our heads. There's not a lot of work out there. Who would we be if we just lived Oh like my god. You are insufferable. Yep. Uh, let me just uh a day at the beach? Skiing the slopes? <laughs> hey. And we can't come to the phone right now. I should... So leave a message at the beep and we'll get back to you as soon as <laughs> humanly possible. Fuck you. Beep. That fucking message. I'm gonna come down there and bash your heads in with that machine if I have to call again and hear that fucking message one more time. Who is that? I've been doing this long enough to know that if you had the cash, you'd have paid by now. So consider yourselves out of warnings. It's time to start thinking about how else you can settle this. Who is that? Who is that? The crooked man's gonna get his, one way or another. Well... <sighs> ah, fucking shit. All I care about is, how can I find the crooked man? Who do I talk to? Where do I go? Oh, come on. The Lucky Pawn. That's where I borrowed the money. And that is where? The Crooked Man's behind that place. I'd overheard people talking to Jersey about loans before. Who's Jersey? So, when I needed money, that's where I went. I didn't know what to do. You could have told me. Wait. Who do you deal with? Jersey. You know, the Jersey Devil. <laughs> oh yeah, that slimy prick. I didn't realize he was back on this side of the river. And those Tweedles were always going in and out. Probably yep. dropping off a loan payment they squeezed out of some poor fable. But never the Crooked Man. Mainly it's just regular fables. I can see now that it was a mistake, but I'm not the only one who goes there, you know. I saw the woodsman's axe there just the other day. It was in a display case. Yeah, Bloody Mary has that. I guess he's hit hard times, too. There's a lot of that going around. I can't imagine he has a lot of marketable skills. Fucking Bloody Mary must go through there. She had Woody's axe last night. Trying to chop my damn head off with it. Yep. Maybe if you go there, you can sort some things out. Mm. I guess I'll go check out the Lucky Pawn. If I can't track down the Crooked Man there, maybe I can make enough noise that the Crooked Man will come find me. Hold on, Bigby. Don't go there. Sounds like you're just going to get Beauty in trouble. Motherfucker, you, and... you don't get what's happening here. You know that butcher shop? The cut above? It's okay. the place on Tubman Street. Same block as the baker and the candlestick maker. Well, I've been delivering packages from there for a while. Oh. The thing is, it's for the Crooked Man. Okay. And I don't think it's meat in the packages. 
You, you gotta understand, I needed work. You have to believe us. We didn't think it would get like this. Yeah. Well, what are you delivering? What's going on there? How does this fit into the crooked man's operation? I couldn't tell you. What are but those scratches? I Did I do, do It's the do only that? meat market in town that doesn't carry filet. I'm not sure how much actual butchery goes on there. How did you get involved with this? Johan the Butcher called. He had a problem with the refrigeration unit one night. But when I finished, it was your pal Mary who showed up to pay me. She said okay. I was reliable. She liked that. And it's the only thing I've been able to pick up. And it's still not enough. I don't want Beauty to have to work. Uh, especially not where she was. Okay. So you do their dirty work. Look the other way. Work is work. All I do is deliver stuff. Sure. I just wanted to provide for beauty. Give her the kind of life she deserves. No, you don't deserve this. We shouldn't have to live like this. Scraping to get Why not? By. None of us should. We were royalty once. We were accustomed to That's a certain your fucking lifestyle. problem. All we want is to make this place feel a little bit like home. Oh, you wouldn't understand, Bigby. Yeah. Fuck off. There are a lot of people who have it a lot worse off than you. Or me, for that matter. So, where are you going? If this all goes sideways, I'd like to know where it's coming from. None of your fucking business. Yeah, where am I going? I don't think I'm going to the butcher, though. I want to know what the crooked man is hiding at that butcher shop. You know, Bigby, once you show up there, word is gonna spread. There may be nothing left for you to see if you go to the Lucky Pond after. Well, I guess okay, I'll whatever. find out. Wait, I don't know what you're planning to do when you find the crooked man, but is there any way you could help us out? You don't deserve what help. Do you mean? Well. Maybe you can make this all just go away. We would really appreciate it. What, you want me to kill the- What do you say? Can you help us out? Fuck you. I don't you. go around fixing debts. Lucky for you, what I am going to do might just fix it anyway. Just keep us in mind, please. I'm sure you'll do the right thing. Oh shit, I hate you so much. You two are the worst. smoking in a whatever I don't even know when this is set I'm just being respectful yeah yeah mm-hmm Huh, empty. Either he's got a whole lot of customers, or he doesn't have any. Yeah, this is the front, clearly. Right. Nobody's here. Oof, this, this... Not very appetizing. New, 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 Frozen new, new. solid. Who'd want to eat this? Again, this is the front. Got everything. Don't ring the. Bet that's what Beast was talking about. So is that. Mm -hmm. So is that symbol for mm. the Crooked Man or. That logo looks familiar. I've seen this before. I think it's for at the, the Tweedles. Man. Hello. Bigby Wolf? Hi. <clears throat> well, welcome, Sheriff. Uh, what can I get for you? You interested in a particular cut? Um, let's see. What do we have in stock? Let's, uh, let's see what we got here. Flank steak on special. New York strip. Uh, oh, I can have some wild boar in tomorrow if you like. Uh, sirloin. I know Bloody Mary hangs around here. Yeah. I want to talk to don't, her. Don't bullshit I, me. I, I don't know what you mean. <laughs> 
<clears throat> what you see is <laughs> what you get. Just meat. You don't find anything else. Well, I think we're going to find a lot. Uh, we do more wholesale and meat packing than walk-up service. I'd like to help you. Really, I would. But there's uh, nothing here. And what if I do find something here? Because if you haven't been straight with me... Really, Sheriff? You won't. We'll see about that. I... Sheriff, I... Did you hear that? What? Fuck. Oh, no, sorry. Hold on. I, I just gotta go check on that. No, Don't go anywhere. Fuck. I'll be right back. Butcher? I just have to go see. Go in there. Now, Bigby. Run. Shit. I got it covered back here, Sheriff. I'll be right out. No, you won't. Are these animals maybe from the farm? No, they wouldn't do that. Oh, fuck. Just wait out front. I'll be right there. I've got a bit of a mess back here. Yeah, don't Look, say anything. Can, can you come back tomorrow, maybe? What am I gonna find? I'm sorry, Sheriff, but you're not supposed to be back here for uh, a safety. Somebody's purposes. gonna. Somebody's gonna attack me. Come on, damn it! What? You're, you you realize you're giving away your position when you drag stuff. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! They're gonna kill me! Oh God, she is gonna fucking kill me! What? Why He's is that? He's gonna get me killed. Things I do. Huh? Hey, on. Please, please, Bigby, please don't. Bigby. What happened to Sheriff? Please don't kill me, Sheriff. I don't want to die. Please, please don't kill me. Listen, just calm the fuck down, okay? I just want some answers. Yeah, what's happening oh, here? Okay, I'm dead. Either way, they said to me, Johan, you could keep your life and lose your shop or lose both. Okay. What would you do? It, it was a simple choice to make in the moment. Easy, mm -hmm. even when they got down the hook in the deep freeze. Just open the door, Johan. Won't be your problem anymore. I think it will I be though. Can't. Why not? What's back there? I don't know. I, honest. I, I've never been back there. It's locked from the other side. Look, I, I just work the front. That's all I'm supposed uh. to do. I've I've actually I haven't been back there in years. I don't know any more than that. Come well, on. Who locked the fucking door? I, I'm not part of their crew. I, I don't know who or, or what goes on Who's back the there. Who's the crew then? Because you knew that. The crooked man's people. Ah. Jersey Devil, Dean Dumb, and that mental case Bloody Mary. You, you want to talk about the real butcher? <laughs> it's her, not me. This is her place. I'm telling you, they muscled in on me. Took over my storage and delivery a long time ago. All because yeah. of that heat wave. That summer was even hotter than this one. Oh, I'd let Mary in those Porkers stay cool in the meat locker one day, playing cards, having a great time. I guess they were sizing the place up. Shows what I get for being nice. No, that's I'm that just a victim in this. That doesn't sound right. I don't know right. what they do back there. I swear. You lied to me in the front. Why the fuck should I believe you now? Because it's the truth. I no, knew this he, would He's going to attack you. Didn't know when. But there... He's going to... Try to attack us, right? I feel like that's gonna happen. Oh, it's a lab. Why is there a lab here? Uh huh. What is all this? Ah, you. You warned them. They ran because of you. Nosebleed. What the fuck? 
What is this place? I told you, Bigby. I don't know. They muscled me out. She signaled. I is, swear, I don't know anything is signal, more. Is I haven't been back here when it was <coughs> for them to run like away. This. Yep. Warning lights. This business. It's all I've ever had. Damn it. You can't act like you're forced into this and then turn around and help them. They'd still be here if you hadn't flipped that switch out there. I had to. Huh. You huh? come in here making trouble for me. But you only give a shit now because the crooked man stepped on your toes. Yeah, I didn't, or something. I didn't know this Where was going on. Where were you when they took this place from me? Did you come? Did you come to the office? It hasn't been easy for me. You, you think I want to live with this at my back? You're not off the fucking hook yet, Butcher. If I find something, if I so much as smell something that makes me think you're lying. What are, what are those things? A A. Oh, there. Uh, is so that this they're... is what Beast was delivering. Glamours. Glamours. Other kinds of magic. Could be dangerous stuff. Okay. That symbol. It's on all the packages. What that's, is it? That's the Crooked Man's That's the Crooked symbol. Man's yeah. uh, brand. It's on everything that goes in and out of here. So you do know something, huh? Is that a, a wheel or what? I guess they never used that thing on wolves, huh? What's that supposed to mean? It's from back in the homelands. It's a torture, a torture device. device. Yeah. It came over here with the rest of our stories. Not that Mondays need any help coming up with that kind well, of thing. Who is the crooked man? It makes people crooked. Like breaking their bones and... Do I really need to explain this? Is that why the crooked man is crooked? Who do they have? So whoever Jeez. was working here, who's getting chained up here? Was chained up. You can't think I'm the only one the crooked man has under his yoke. Where did the blood come from? Ah, fuck. This can't be good. Maybe just don't touch. These are raw materials for making magic. Anti Greenleaf. So and it's any other rogue witches out there probably get their supplies here. Huh. But what is what is this on the table though? What are they making here? I'm just a butcher. You wanna talk T bones? <laughs> that I can do. This stuff is out of my league. Tongue of dog. There are a lot of nasty spells you can make with the right equipment. Hamlin curds. Okay. Don't you see what's going on here? All these raw materials. It looks like he could process them into just about any kind of magic. Yeah. He's got all he needs. The gear. And slave labor. That to might work be what in. the prostitutes are working on. What so is that? These must be the orders. Oh. He's got his hooks into everybody. And it's pretty Mr. clear Knight. now. Oh, yeah? How? Doing it like this. It's bound to be cheaper than the 13th floor. Yep. This is just horrible. The things that must have gone on here. What? Why are you acting in? Is it all this happened? It's a sunflower, I rose didn't red. See it. Didn't stop rose it. Rose red. Ha, <laughs> good one. This is a whole lot bigger than we thought. People just don't know the real cost of getting something cheap. You don't have to tell me. That fucker Crane knew all about it. Yeah, what about Crane? What are you this talking all, about? I mean, finding the crooked man is so fucking important. Why don't you ask your boss? Snow. No, Crane. What? He said he knows where everybody is. I don't know how, but he's got it some way. That's right. It was that creepy magic mirror with the so big green hand. Crane, Crane was working for, Why don't for the you crooked just man. Use that. Find the crooked man that way. And leave me alone. Yeah, with stuff like that mirror, I'm surprised that you ever need to leave the office. Hmm. Can't you just vaporize anyone who gives you trouble? None of your business, Butcher. Don't worry about it. Okay. Yeah, fuck off. Well, if they got their hands on an important magical item, there's only one place they'd take it. 
Who? The Lucky Pawn. Okay, they right. probably took Crane there too. The Lucky Pawn. I hope I, have, I can find I the I mirror piece anything. there. I can find the Crooked Man. Hey, hold on. Well, I'm real happy you found what you're looking for, Bigby. But what about me? What about you? Huh? What the hell am I supposed to do now? It's your fucking problem. I'm gonna have to spend the rest of my short life looking over my shoulder for Bloody Mary. They won't care that I held up my end. There's no way yeah. to get out of this. You won't have to worry, Johan. I'm gonna take him down. Thank you. Don't know how, but... Thank you, Sheriff. We'll figure out. How about you actually have a shop that does something? Jersey, don't don't give me that shit. What the fuck is the point of having a system if you're just gonna my fucking Jack, system? What the fuck is going on? But you I'm a uh, guy who just gonna sure. I'm Jack, guy you're sus as yeah. fuck. It, Woody. If you love your ex so fucking much, why'd you pawn it in the first fucking place, huh? Jack is really suspicious. I didn't pawn it, asshole. It was. So get the fuck out of my sight. Hit the bricks. See you later. Hey, who are you? What's going on here? The oh, fucking it's hell. It's Jersey Devil. And this fucking guy too? Are you kidding me? It was here. It was right fucking here. What did you do with it? How the fuck do I know? Listen, you bald little dipshit. You're gonna <clears throat> Yeah, you, you need to piece of shit. Woody. Cool it, Woody. Back off, dog. This doesn't concern you. You need to stop. We don't need the business office involved in this shit. Yeah, what, what is... What is your fucking Yeah, what problem? is your fucking problem? Just stay out of my way, all right? How you feeling today, Sheriff? <sighs> what the fuck Still do you think you're doing? Whoever killed them hookers? Or are you done chasing your tail? Yep. Ah! Where's my ass? Who'd you give it? You're done fucked up now, right? Stop, Woody. Woody, stop. This is my fucking fight. I know Not where now, I know where your axe is. You got a lot of nerve. Oh fuck. Oh that ain't good. Fuck, I, sh I shouldn't get into this fight. Yeah. Stop it. Oh, there it is. It's right there. Protected your friend. Too bad you couldn't protect those whores. <laughs> Go on. Try to stop me. I see the axe, though. Fucking stay down. There she is. Oh, fuck. I just can't help getting into fights. Uh, uh, like that. I really hate these fights, though. Uh, no. Uh, uh, come on, Big B. Ow. Fuck. Are we gonna have? Uh, are we gonna end up killing this guy? Come on! Yeah, no. <laughs> oh, Wood is gonna kill him. If he, if he starts moving now. Hey, assholes. I assholes? Oh, 
Also, uh, no. You did pawn, pawn your axe. That's, that's on you. Don't. The magic mirror's missing shard. Where is it? Bloody Mary brought it here, didn't she? You don't know anything about anything, do you? What do you have? Nothing. Had ah, useless bitch Snow White in a uh. broken fucking mirror. No fucking friends. Where's the crooked man? How can I find him? You can't find a crooked man. No one can. Oh, crooked man the finds you. His house. It bounces around. Never in oh. one spot. You'll never find it. Interesting. Even Crane had to use the magic mirror. They dumped all his shit here. Bloody Mary uses this place like a fucking dump. Okay. Where's Crane's stuff? Where'd they put it? In back. That's all of it? Just go on. Get Crane's shit and go. Not that it's gonna do you any good. Why is it not gonna do us anything? any good? Crane's coat. Uh huh. No time for traveler's checks, huh? Keep it. He won't be needing this anymore. Yeah, don't do that face. That sick piece of. Yeah. The shard. It's the shard. Noise. Finally. Yeah, it was the shard should have been much bigger. Is that all you needed? Hey, Sheriff. What? Those girls are still dead. Oh, and there's nothing you can do to bring them back. What are you doing? And I don't know what they did, but I do know this. Oh, if they're dead, it's because the crooked man wanted them dead. That's all it takes. Sure. So you can raw smash the place up. <laughs> Shit. You can wail on me all you want. Do you, but what good is it? Do you have no instinct for self-preservation? He ain't in your town. You're in his. And he sure as shit is ready for you. Hmm. Yeah, Woody. Um also you did pawn your cool. axe. Uh Goody grand. Fuck you. You're welcome. I'm not gonna lie. I was having trouble deciding which one of you to hit with this thing. Jersey was wrong, you know. About what? Like, yeah. About those girls. There is something. Get the fucker who did it. Sure. Ain't that the plan? Believe yeah. me, that's all I've been doing this whole damn time. All right, go do it then. Mm. Hey, Woody. Yeah. You gonna be all right? <sighs> no me. You should come around. You know it's pretty weird for a guy to just be walking around New York with an axe, right? I don't care who killed the prostitutes. If Crane was helping himself to the community coffers, it means his hand was in my pocket. And you just let him go! I don't know what you oh, heard. Come but it didn't on, Bluebeard. Like that. Are you denying the facts? She's denying me the chance to get a word in. Now, Miss White. Oh, Sheriff Bigby has returned. Yeah, you need to get oh, the, the fuck out. Bowl himself. Bigby, 
Where have you been? I'm not finished here, Miss White. You will have to wait. <sighs> Just one moment, please. Look what I found. Seems your dog wants a biscuit. <laughs> You're asking for it. Buffkin, get this piece in the mirror right away. With pleasure, Miss White. <sighs> yeah, Finally, that's a good way to cut Things are cut swinging your hand. back in the right direction. Good work, Bigby. You've been gone all day. What did you uncover? I thought you were going to report back to yeah, me. Maybe we should. I mean, it's fine. So what else did you find out? Fuck. All right. Sheriff, I could use your assistance. Would you join me at the mirror? Assistance? Why do you need assistance? Don't go far, Sheriff. I'd like to have a few words of my own with you. I'm believable. Why don't you go fuck off until I'm good and ready? Yep. I don't understand. This piece just doesn't want to join the rest. Do you have any idea why? Got me. There might be a sound spell. Well, where did you find it? What has it gone through since being separated from the rest? Shattering is a very traumatic experience, you know. So this process can be a little touchy. Yeah. It helps that I have a good working relationship with the mirror. I found it in Crane's coat. The last person I saw with Crane or his coat was that psycho Bloody Mary. Maybe she had some... Ah, yes. Miss White was asking about her. That explains it. You know who and the mirror have a very unhappy history with each other. Well, how would you like it if she tried to use you as a doorway? I think I already know the feeling. Oh, right. Well, I think I know how to proceed now. It will just take a little extra coaxing. That's all. Thank you for your help. Okay. It could be a while, Sheriff. I'll find you when it's ready. Besides which, he might not want to come out with you watching. Oh, he doesn't like being spied on. If you ask me, you're everything that's wrong with Fabletown. Fuck you. Is it fixed? Did you ask about the crooked man? Buffkin's still working it's on it. It's complicated. He said it might be a while. If you're so self reliant, what do you want from the business office so bad? What I want is my business. I can't take those two right now. Yeah, fuck. We're trying tell, to catch the a murderer, off. and they're... They're over there bickering about bureaucracy. We're at war. Don't they realize that? Mm, I don't think they do. Do you need some help over there? Yeah, thanks. Go talk to Toad. But just so you know, we can't pay him. Yeah, I can. He really needs to go to the farm, you know. So just break the news and be done with it, okay? Toad, come here. I thought I made myself very clear. I see how it is. Passed off to an underling, eh? Toad, calm down. Well, you did cause what damage brings me in here, so maybe it's for the best. Just need a little bit of dosh to cover it. I tried talking to her about it, but it's like chatting up a brick wall, it is. Hmm. Now, I'm sure you've got your own agenda, Sheriff, but I've taken a real wallet because of you, and you can't deny that. Yeah. Before we get into any of that, what do you know about the Crooked Man? Don't try to change a subject on me. I need a little bit of that walking around money, you know? My car, total, the gaping mall in my wall, any of us sound familiar? Sure. I'm not looking for a handout, just what's right. Here, Crane won't be getting any use out of this. Will that do? Crane's money, eh? Well, I suppose that means it belongs to me as much as anybody. Yeah. Thank you, Sheriff. Use it to get glamour, Toad. You got the money now, so I won't be so lenient if I catch you again. And the farm is always on the table. Yeah. But of course. You have to understand. Can you tell me more? Bluebeard, you want to talk? Now's your chance. I've just fucker. made my donation funding this office, so direct your questions to Miss White. Well, at least he's not trying to get rid of me. He's not? For now. Did you take care of Toad? I mean, I saw the way he left. I know it may not seem that important right now, but glamours are the law for a very good reason. You know that as well as anyone. Well, did you or didn't you? Dude, <sighs> it's complicated. Fine, we'll deal with it later. I know I should be asking how it got like this. 
but I just keep wondering why it happened to Faith and Lily. You've seen his world. Do you have any idea why he'd want them dead? I don't know if the crooked man killed them with his own hand or if it was one of his goons. No, it's about control. If there's one thing I've figured out, it's that the crooked man is all about control. It's what he does with the loans at the pawn shop, the magic he peddles, chains, ribbons. Maybe yep. Faith and Lily weren't doing what they were told. Or maybe they just tried to leave. Sheriff, Miss White, I believe the mirror is repaired. Cool. I have to say, I have been better. But thanks for putting me back together. I'm sorry, I just... I have to know. Mirror, mirror, we're glad you weren't slain. Now please show us that sick creep crane. Good one. Are you really sure you want to see him? I think his lips are sealed. You no? will get on that plane to Paris, and you will wait for the day the Crooked Man needs to you. Paris. Until then, not a peep. Otherwise, I get to deal with you my way. So please, please disobey. Wait okay. a minute. Someone's watching. Oh, they, they have a way of knowing. Oh, fuck. Oh, shit. What? Just happened we pointed you in the wrong direction we looked at bloody mary's reflection oh her that explains the sting i'd rather not have to feel the pain she brings yeah so let's not do that again okay <laughs> looks like we'll have to track him down later you're right we need to focus on the paris. immediate threat by paris and that's the crooked just, man just to lay low right bigby we don't have a lot of time are you having trouble with the rhyme, Sheriff? <sighs> mirror, mirror, no time to pout. So where does Crooked Man hang out? Good one. I don't recognize the door, but that's the Crooked Man symbol on it. Hold off. Nope, that's gone. Ah. The door, it moves. Yeah. Yeah, we knew that. You mentioned that. Wait a minute. I know that door. That's Central Park. I don't know when it's gonna move again, but I'm gonna get there before it does. Bigby, wait. Yeah, we're gonna get in trouble. When you though. get the crooked man, make sure you bring him back alive. He has to stand trial. We can't That's just dispense difficult. street justice. Street I know justice. that emotions can run high, and you have your reasons to handle this a certain way. But we have to make a commitment to working within the law. Yeah, I'll catch okay. him and bring him back here, alive. Then we can clean him. And I still don't know who, who the crooked man is. Good. I have enough to worry about here while I prepare the case against him. Bloody, so I'm going to trust have you to handle on this Bloody properly. Mary as well. That is, if you think you're ready. Of course I'm ready. I got no other choice. Who's that? Oh, it's, it's me! Can you just open it? Open it. Ooh, fuck. Yep. Yeah. Can I just get in? Ah, shit. This might be bad. Oh. Tim! What the hell are you Tim? doing here? Good evening, Sheriff. I'm here to take you to the boss. Thanks, by the way, for leaving off Tiny. Tim I have to admit, when they asked me to watch the door, Christmas Carol? I wasn't sure what to expect when you came through that portal. I know you aren't here on a social call, so thanks for not giving me a hard time. Okay. What is this place? Or where is it? I know I'm not in Central Park anymore. I'm not sure. I've only ever come in through one of the portals. I don't think you can get in from the actual street. 
Okay. But you can't blame him for wanting to make it hard to find. Brr. I'm supposed to bring you right on in. So what am so I? What am I missing? You'll come this way. It would Look, be would be funny if it, if it was Scrooge. This is the one thing I have to do. Please don't make this hard on me. Fine. Lead on. Okay. Who is the crooked crooked man though? This is all very creepy. Thanks for understanding. This yes, is all I'm going right? to do, and I don't want to mess it up. <laughs> I know I'm probably the last person you'd expect to be a guard, or an escort for that matter. I was a little surprised mm. myself when they asked me to do it. I thought it was a joke, actually. Yeah. I'm an easy target. You shouldn't be here, Tim. This place is dangerous. Yeah, but what else, what else is he gonna do? Like you. It's not like that. Whatever you may think of him, he doesn't treat me like some broken little kid. I think he gets what it's like. He gave me a job. Yep. And I'm lucky to have it. This is the only option I've got. Just keep that in mind, maybe? Because if you and the boss go up against each other, the rest of Fable Town is going to get caught yeah. in the middle. I can find the door myself. You should just get the hell out of here. Things are going to get ugly in a minute. Leave? I told you, I have to do this. Hey, you've been warned. Stick around, and you're a part of this, just Tim. like anyone else. A lot of us depend on him. Some of us never get to the front of the line at the business office. But he's there. Yep. We need you, but we need him too. What we don't need is a war. Hey, Sheriff, hold up. I gotta go in with you. Can't you just wait up, Sheriff? No. I don't have time for this. Sorry, Tim. God bless us, everyone. Hmm. <laughs> Boom. Am I some kind of a fucking joke to you? What did I tell you, eh? Stop laughing at me. Oh, yeah? Northern accent. Okay. How polite of you to knock. Sheriff Wolf, sir. Okay, Jersey. Am I gonna see the crooked man? Thank you, Tim. Is it gonna be screwed? The sheriff isn't the no, it isn't. accommodating sort. Who are you? you it. You did well. I don't know who you are. You go now. Thank you, sir. There's a lot of people in here. You see, everyone in Fable Town has a role to fill. You just have to pay attention to what they need to help them find it. Sure. Oh, that's a lot of people. Why don't you have a seat, Sheriff? We have a great deal to discuss. Okay. Why do I feel like the episode is going to end here? Fuck!